T minus four days until India. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you're here. You're catching me walking in the streets of downtown DC for my orientation for World Heritage USA. I am very excited. So if you don't know, I am going to India. Crazy. <laughs> I'm going to India in like four days. Um, with World Heritage, I'll be working with one of their partner companies and I'm really excited. It's gonna be an amazing experience. One, working within historic preservation, specifically with an architecture firm, and then also just learning about built heritage. But I decided to wake up early and go to mass. And now I am going back to the hotel and we will begin orientation very soon. <laughs> Okay guys, we are at the airport. Um, I'm at IAD, Dulles Airport. And I am on my way to Dubai actually. That's our first stop before Hyderabad. So only one layover, seven hours. You can actually leave the Dubai airport, but I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. I have seven hours, but definitely not enough. If I had like 15, maybe I would. to Dubai which is good I'm so tired though it is 8 a.m. no it's 9 a.m. Dubai time and that means it's it is 1 a.m. 
Philly East Coast time. So I'm just like in and out of it. I will not be leaving Dubai Airport. <laughs> I'm too tired to do that. But um, I think I'm gonna try to find the Zen Gardens and just relax. I know that's like, I'm in Terminal 3, Gate B. So I'm gonna, I think it's around here. So I will be finding that and hanging out for a bit and then just finding some food. Right now I'm in like this little courtyard area. Which is I love airports because I worked on airport projects for a summer, like two summers ago. So it's really fun exploring the airport. My flight was also really great, by the way. It was probably one of the best 13 hour flights I've ever been on. I've gone to Nigeria a little bit shorter than that. And I think I slept for at least four or five hours, which isn't bad. Got to do some edit the video. I watched a show called Young Rock. And it's about Dwayne The Rock Johnson. I didn't know he had a TV show, but it was funny. Like, I would finish that season. Um, so I'm gonna look out for it. But yeah, that's my update for now. And let's try to find the Zen Garden and then get some food because I will be hungry soon. I don't know if I should stay awake or like, maybe I nap for like another two hours. I have until three o'clock <laughs> to my next flight. And it is like, as I said, 9 a.m. So we'll see. I've given up on the search <laughs> already. I asked someone and they were like, what are you talking about? So that was my cue to give up. I'm so tired. <laughs> so I'm gonna take a nap and then maybe try to look again later. <laughs> Can you tell I'm tired? <laughs> maybe this is local. European but it looks yummy so I'll try it. This is a cute background but okay guys the scoop is they no longer have the Zen Gardens so I was on a wild goose chase wild goose hunt chase it just doesn't exist <laughs> anymore which is really sad a nice little a nice can't speak a sweet lady let me know and I really appreciate her. So in summary I'm unimpressed with the airport so far and Maybe you guys can let me know if there's something else I'm missing, but I'm going to give up on exploring and just like sit at this cute little coffee shop with my London frappe and a Cumberland chicken sandwich roll and just relax. <laughs> I, was, I had big hopes for this Dubai layover, but it's not panning out and that's okay. We'll get to Hyderabad. That's what we're waiting for. <laughs> First meal in India. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's really good. Let's try it. Goat meat. This is my first time cooking. Well, I'm just warming up a meal that I made. It's really day one of Hyderabad. Very low simmer. I've done it. I put it back in the bowl. Okay, now bye. <laughs> this is my first time trying pizza. Obviously not pizza in general, pizza while here in India. <laughs> my pizza unboxing. Uh, okay, so it's a chicken pizza. Okay, now the taste test. Okay, not bad. A lot more flavor than I was expecting. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I turned the camera off way too fast. It's super spicy and I just was not expecting that, so I might not, I might wait a little bit until I'm like really hungry and I'm like, okay, I will, I will eat this. So yeah, not my favorite, but that's okay. We live and we learn. So now I know <laughs> plain cheese pizza might be a better option next time.
I am in Hyderabad. I'm very happy to have made it. It is a lovely morning. Um, I actually woke up and like, ooh, my voice is cracking. I woke up feeling really great, but I know I'm probably gonna crash in a few hours, so I'm not working today. Um, so as you guys probably know, I'm working with World Heritage USA. So the internship part should start tomorrow, which is Wednesday. Today's Tuesday, rest day get my stuff together day and then we begin working so yes i'm very happy to be here the flight was not awful i took a nap i was sitting next to the sweetest woman um she gave me her number and everything she's like i live in hyderabad i will do is from Hyderabad, lives in Dubai, and was like, let me know if you need anything. So I was like, people here are already so kind. Like, <laughs> and then my um, host company and coworkers came and picked me up. And it's really nice. This is my little home. Really, it's a small little um, room. I'm living with a coworker, I think I mentioned that. Um, but yes, very excited and I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Stay tuned for the next vlog, which is going to be my first week in Hyderabad. I am so, I'm just so thankful to God that I made it here safely and really happy that so far things have been wonderful. It is really hot here though. <laughs> I will say it is warm, but a lot of things are like reminiscent of Nigeria for me. Like, I don't know, it feels like I'm home. It's very familiar, even though it's obviously so different <laughs> of a place. But yeah, the food has been good so far. I had black eyed peas for breakfast. Yesterday at the airport, I had mutton and rice and it, it tasted like I was having like fried rice and goat meat. So all my Nigerians are like, yeah, that's what we eat that all the time. I'm like, yeah, I feel like I'm at home. Like, <laughs> like this is great. Um, yeah, so I'm very happy, very excited, and so grateful that you guys are following along on this journey. I'm so excited to update you in my next video, hopefully next week. So I will see you guys soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye.